guys welcome back to the channel uh, today I'm gonna give you guys the uh, uh, my first update and uh, semi completion on, on some of the stuff that I've been working on um, I gotta tell you guys that I have been I've been having fun with this stuff I usually do one kit at a time but um, I think I, I I put way too much on my plate but um, I'm, 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 I'm doing it so um, I'm gonna start off with the first one. And there's a little twist towards the end of the video and I'll show you guys what happened and um, and the reason why. And there's a really special surprise towards the end. And this is something that, um, uh, I'll, I'll just let you guys know towards the end, but let's just go ahead and start with the first one. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with uh, the Hot Wheel. And as you can see, I changed the wheels of it. Um, my son had a, a Hot Wheel that had these wheels on. And I was like, hey, those looks like steelies. And if you guys know me, uh, I like steelies on certain cars. So there, here's your, so it's completely rusted out even underneath. Okay, that's that one. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the bone shaker. completely rusted out uh, the interior for the dash I just painted it black painted the battery and the chrome I just did a, a flat um, clear just to kind of dull down the, um, the chrome the underneath and that's those are done okay I'm gonna show you guys the 49.4. The 49.4 is done, and this I was I was having way too much fun with this stuff. It's like uh, way too much fun with this one. What do you think? It's pretty rusty, right? It's like found this at a pond and got you know taken out of the pond, and it was just it's pretty horrible. Everything it's yeah, it's I like it. It's pretty cool. I never thought that the rust technique doing it. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, I'm 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 stoked and shocked and it's it's crazy how this turned out to be. And um, I'm gonna show you guys the other side. Are you guys ready? Bam. Uh, I was just messing with it, and I was like, you know what? What the heck not? Graffiti is not supposed to be perfect. This is something that some kids were just out there messing around with spray cans, and just some amateur kid was trying to do spray can, and uh, just went at it. And that's how we all start. We start with something small, and you know, next thing you know, they're doing big. Uh, tankers and, and semis and trailers and uh, trains and you name it okay so now moving on to the Gundam here's um, here's the story of this little Gundam so as you guys remember my first video I was gonna do this one so I was getting ready to hack it like literally I had my knives my Dremel, everything, it's gonna be battled and it's gonna have some rust. It's, it's been out and on, you know, war, and um, I'm still trying to figure it out what type of scenery I'm gonna do for the, um, for the, uh, for the diorama. And I wanna do it kind of, kind of like a, a building, but as I'm getting ready to do this and start cutting this Gundam, my son goes, Wait, what are you doing? I go, I'm getting ready to do destroy it and I think it was just me saying I'm getting ready to destroy it he just went no I don't want so I gotta change Gundam so he doesn't want me to do that so I went and pulled my stash and I'm going to do this one so this is my this is my Gundam I, I bought this one I put this one together so uh, it's, it's got good lines so and I'm gonna show you guys the diorama so the diorama, it's gonna be like that. Move this out of the way, so you guys can see. 
So. It's been into battle and I already started glowing. As you can see, it's just still glowing. So, and I did kind of like the silhouette for, um, it's kind of when something like this. So it's gonna sit like that. It's gonna, well, I'm gonna move the camera or my phone actually. So you guys can, can see. So it's gonna sit like that. It's gonna, um, I'm, I have um, a, some concrete color. So this is gonna be concrete. All this is gonna be concrete. So it's like if it hit a, a, a a concrete wall and it's just been sitting there so I'm gonna rust whatever I can and do battle damage and everything and if I can if I can find some wire I'm not just gonna take the arm off and and um, find a real nice drill bit so I could just do a a, a hole in there so, I, so it went and, and landed on a street ball okay so that's that so there's um, I'm subscribed to this to this um, channel, and when I was talking to to this guy, his name is Pat. So I was talking to Pat, and um, I like the diversity diversity and the artwork that he does is just out of this world. Um, if you guys think that doing a rust on a plastic. It's pretty crazy now imagine doing rust on a piece of paper kind of like my shop card uh, it took me a while to figure out how to do the rust but this guy did it on the actual piece of paper and I was talking to him and I go hey I'm doing a group bill. I would love to see you do a rusty a draw a rusty car so he goes sure I'm gonna do a, a on my next video I'm gonna do a rusty car but he never mentioned what it was until later he goes oh I'm gonna do a 32 Ford so I was like, sure. So I'm gonna show you guys the drawing. So he did this. I'll link his channel down below so you guys could go and see. So this is part of the group build, but he didn't put the um, the rust bucket group build. But on the uh, on the previous video, it's, you can see that we we talked about it, and and this is part of the group build. So. So I told him that that was pretty cool, and he was nice enough that he sent me an email with this, so I can actually do um, a, a big poster this big. So I have to go to um, a, a print place so that they could just blow it up. So I, I print this at home, so it's just printed, uh, just normal paper, but this is just so cool just to see and the detail that it he did and it's all pencil it's pen and pencil that's all there is and that's art to me that's art so um, that's about it guys um, <sighs> just you know I'm really enjoying the um, uh, the group build and what I'm working on and I'm looking at everybody else's entries and and all the work that everybody's putting in and it's pretty awesome and and i i really appreciate you guys um jumping in and and i can see the uh the, that you guys are having fun doing the, the rust bucket and if you don't know how to do rust um look at my tutorial and see if you can i i know manny over at um money manny skill modeling podcast he he took the 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 tutorial and he did it and he's doing rust the same way I'm doing it and it's it's pretty cool so if you guys never done it just look at that and I mean look at all the other guys how they do their weathering I mean it's I'm not saying the mine is perfect but it's just um it's just to have fun so all right guys so thanks for stopping by um again I do appreciate everyone who um uh, jumped into this group build um appreciate all the likes all the shares and all the subscriptions and um, uh, it looks like it's it's it turned out pretty good I have a good amount of, of, of people that signed up and I'm, I'm pretty sure by next year it'll probably be um, uh, I really hope that it'll be bigger and 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 with bigger and better builds I guess 
Alright guys, I'll see you guys on the next one. Happy modeling.